Okay, guys. There you go. Third series of the day. You know? And let's go. Let's really go. Incas Portuguese. Tatot with Incas. Leary Portuguese. Remember that this can be a great series. Insane. I don't know who is going to win. But Leary series are always, always faster, you know? Always faster, you know? Okay. Give me a moment. And Incas Catalan Portuguese. What do we prefer here? I'm gonna go for the overlays. And uh, Incas versus Portuguese. There you go, guys. What do you prefer here, guys? Because Portuguese is great, but Incas is insane. So I will say that probably, I don't know, probably I prefer Incas. It's very dangerous, you know. And goal in front, stone on the right, berries at the back. Historically, Leary has very good results against Tato. But in the most important matchups they played, Tato won to Leary, you know? Tato won to Leary, so, oh boy. After this series, guys, the Viper versus Hera, okay? The Viper versus Hera. Fourth quarter final. For those people that might be thinking why they are in the quarterfinals, blamed out. Blamed out, guys. You know? Doubt won the Viper in the group stage. That's it. <laughs> okay. Goal at the back. Three villages on wood at the back, okay. And the. Uh, the berries are in front, but I prefer map from Tato because he has stone at the back, gold at the back, wood at the back. Except the berries, everything is at the back. Well, Thank you for following. Leary has only the berries at the back. It's true that it's Portuguese and berries can be very strong, but you know, it's complicated, right? If I look on Wikipedia, will it spoil results? For this tournament, no. We are, this is recorded games, but this broadcasting live, let's say. This because uh, the host of this tournament, that is Nacho AOE, you know, a YouTube uh, Argentinian streamer, is casting this at the same time. So nobody knows the result of this series. So if you want to check the, the information from this event, you can check on Wikipedia for sure, you know? Yeah, it's recorded games, but it's like live, you know, because nobody knows. It's all private, you know? Yeah. Efficiency is very good for both, for Tato and Leary. Okay. Doing the mill now. And the next one is gonna be is gonna be the loom. Remember that Tato should be in a good shape in 1v1. He was playing the Harris uh, Championship Invitational. Leary didn't play. He declined the invitation. I don't know the reasons. Maybe he was busy or he was too many games for him. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't speak to him, not gonna lie. I didn't ask. Sometimes I, I, I will have asked, but this time I didn't. So let's see how Leary's shape is going to be. In the first uh, series, I don't think he played really great, but in the second, it was already much better. So let's see. You can see Lee going up 19 population faster than Tatot. Didn't wall completely the, the map, not at all. And. Okay. Lee can see now the militias. He react right away, but he knows that the militias are coming. Leary is not mining gold. He's walling the wood, but his goal is terrible, as I told you. 
It's really, really terrible. Okay. Remember, the winner of this series will face in semifinals the Viper or Hera. My goodness. He's going a scout. Wow. I'm surprised. Lee love the, the archers, but he's going to scouts. He's not the standard from him. He did one spear, but he's coming with three militias. Three militias. He need to wall the wood. Yeah. He's gonna take the, the house. Maybe. It's 50 wood. But he's gonna kill the eagle. Yeah. Uh oh. He's a wall. A gate? Yeah. Palisade and a house. 50 wood, remember? So now he can't do really too much there. Archie range right away. Okay. Well, he has the Archie range already. Remember cheaper units? She's really good. For Incas, I would say. I don't know. I mean, he's gonna take the house. Think he's gonna be houses? Oh. Yeah, man, just look. Now Lear will be housed. Yeah, this house is take all the population. Should do the tone watch probably, but he's not doing. Okay. Not housed anymore. And he's doing a skirmish. He's trying to make a counterattack. But Tatot, it's fully wall. Doing the blasphemy. I mean it's open, but goal wall. Wood wall. Yeah, everything is safe, you know? Everything is really safe. He has the pledging already, he has the skirmishes, but he's housing the guy. Not a lot of idle TC, but with pledging, this is gonna be huge, but he has the skirmishes here. He's gonna be able to defend? I think he will. Yeah, he need to kill the archers. Let's see the micro, and here we are with the four scouts. For now, the KD, you can see. Great micro here by both. They are basically not losing anything. He knows that his opponent has fletching, okay. And he has so many scouts, what the hell. All the reinforcement here, yeah. All right, he got already six scouts for skirms. Gotta be careful, it's too many units. But Lee need the, pl the plasma, he's not doing and he's still full open, crazy. Yeah, he's gonna try to kill the archers and if he kill the archers, he's gonna be fine I believe. He's taking the spears. Focus now in the spears? Yes, he will. Full micro by the kid. Yeah. He's killing those spears and then with his scout and his skirmishes might be able to dominate. Probably. Gotta be careful. Obviously without pledging is not the best. Guys, that would not even double attacks. No horse collar. And it's walling all the map and now doing the tower. The berries are gone, so. Put him away from the from the berries now. Plasmid and mining camp. Very smooth. Gameplay by both. Now, now I don't see Leary a little bit too. Fletching already on the way. And this army is gonna be lovely now for Leary. Might kill some villains here. He gotta kill the spears. Got it. Ooh, almost. But now he got the hill advantage. Oh my god. Sticking the arches? Okay. Well. I love when I see these open maps without walls and juice aggression with army, man. Controlling the units, both flyers, scout and skirmishers. The Leo is playing really smooth, my guys. Really, really smooth. He's doing now the market. And yeah, no horse collar. Oh, the hole here. It's gonna cost Tato the game. It's gonna cost Tato the game, probably. The scouts are now on the wood line. He got the skirmishes with Fletching. And if he micro... Oh, man. You gotta be careful. Yeah, but with the micro that Leo is showing in this game... Six zero units! Leo still didn't lose a single unit. How? How is possible? 
I mean, seriously. Now he will, I believe. This is bloodlines already. Okay. Uh, seven, uh, zero. Is, uh, he's gonna lose some unit. Leary? I mean, lose something, man. Okay, he lost one skirmisher. 10 1. What the hell? Okay, he's killed Bard in armor. He's doing all the upgrades. And Tato is out of wood right now. Sell the stone. He's going all aggressive. What the hell? He's buying resources now. And this is with Bloodlines and plus one scouts, guys. Bloodlines plus one scout. Check the score right now, guys. I don't know if the score is the most important here, but it looks scary. 54 population is now housed. Need to make houses here. Okay. Doing another barrack. And Leary with Bloodlines. Skill bar and armor. More army. It's gonna go up to Castle Age. You gotta be kidding me. What? Wow. He's on the way to Castle Age. Seriously? I mean, for real? Okay. Still lose okay for Tatot? Yeah, yeah. In, in, in two minutes he will resign. So look how okay it is. How he's okay for Tatot? He's up to Castle Age, man. And he's not even close. He's doing the market now. He might buy some resources. Oop. Well. Um, yeah, he's just waiting for being castle. He's doing 40 now. He's gonna try to kill some villages here. And he got it. How many? One only. But now, if he kill those eagles, he's gonna go away a little bit. Coming with the eagles. Those eagles got some upgrades, plus one armor. But Tato is unable to go up yet. And now those scouts might kill the eagles. Yeah, they are fully upgraded, guys. So those eagles going down? Okay, it didn't. But is this trade a good trade for, for Tato? Well, he's about to go up. In 30 seconds, he's in castle. He's also here with the scouts. Well, the eagles are powerful, huh? Even with bladders and plus one, plus one couldn't kill. Okay. 48 population, 53, but now he's going to be in castle. The scouts are coming. Doing another stable. Double attack now. Aye, aye, aye. And he's in castle. Age. And Tatot called the GG. I told you, man. He called the GG. I think he could have stayed because he cleared all the scouts. He stayed a little bit, but Lee was already doing chain bar and armor. Lee won. Tatot, zero. Oh, boy. Well, he only lost the scout at the end, but definitely uh, Tatot was really far from going up. Obviously, uh, Mr. Yo and ACCN will never resign, you know, but uh, statistics. How was the, the APM? <laughs> what? 125 APM? Seriously? And Tatot was 77. That is okay. 125 APM. Statistics military. 1317, he got more KD economy, 1000 more food, 1000 more wood. Obviously, Tato with more gold, and he was in castle, it's 21 minutes. Well, he resigned because even if he lost the scouts, he will not do anything against the knights plus two coming. As simple as that. Yeah. GG, guys, game two. Okay, guys. A map that I'm not a brutal fan, but let's go. I'm gonna keep since this is green Arabia. I'm gonna keep Lee as a blue, Tatot as a red. Also, he picked blue because in this map, green can be very confusing, you know. So let's see what we're going to see now. And Franks, Ikas. Okay, there you go. I don't know what I prefer here, to be honest. Because without gold, maybe maybe Franks are better. But it's true that Incas can make Tower Rush. I don't know. We'll see. It's gonna try to lame with the Eagle, probably. But there's not much to lame. Maybe he's just gonna push the Deers to his own base. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Yeah, there's no boars, remember? No elephants. 
Okay. Remember this map? The goal is outside. You need to cut here to go outside and see what's going to do. So, uh, Tato is going to try to place something uh, dirty, not meta. Obviously, this is not a meta map, of course. Okay. Doing the lumber camp on the right. While Tatot is not gonna make a lumber camp there. Okay. Oh, this is this is important, man. Yeah, but, but he's pushing. He's fine. He limited already one deer. He has the other two on the right, and let's see. Yeah. I, I don't know what is gonna be the approach. Spear skirmishes and towers? Or just towers? What is Prank going to do? Remember that there is no goal and all these scouts. Well, we'll see. Okay. Okay. What happened? Oh, I will I will pay the betting and I will yeah. The mods are Titanic, I know. I will go now for the betting, don't worry. Game two. You have two minutes to make the betting, guys. Oh, there was one that made the betting now. Nice. Viper play after this series. The Viper versus Hera after this series. After Tato versus Leary, okay? So, the Viper versus Hera after this one, amigos. Remember that we have announced already most of the details from Warlords. We'll have more soon. And uh, it's $50,000 prize pool tournament, guys. 50k, 16 players, okay? Sick. Really sick. Winchester. I was talking about Warlords 2, and uh, now you know, 50k event, and it's gonna be the next moon. Thank you, Mr. Winchester, for the raid. Love it. Love it. Okay. Inkless Franks. Both are going up. Lear is going up a little bit faster. And then I want to ask you guys in this map, what civilization you prefer? I think France can be great if you reach castles and make castles and get the goal. But if, if you don't get into that stage, I don't know what you can do with them. I believe that the Incas might be stronger. You know? It's difficult, man. It's difficult, amigos. Yeah, they're fine. They also have the berries that are great. They have the bonus, so... Let's see. I mean, it's not my favorite map. I mean, I like it a lot more in the past. I don't like that much anymore. You know? Because it's kind of predictable. And if one player gets denied to go outside... Oh, nothing to do. A spear and a skirmishers. Well, Lee is not that kind of a player to go crazy on Tower Rush, so he seems to be going just his spears and scams. Okay. And then he's going stable. Interesting. Well, a scout with more HP. That's the berries. And here. Well, Incas, one house is. 20 population, remember? So two houses, 45. My goodness. Okay. Spears are coming. 
Spear and Skirmisher, so it's gonna be annoying. Doing another mill. And he's gonna use Billions, man. Ay, ay, ay. Obviously, he needs to wall here. He's not walling anything. He's going forward. Juice aggressive. He's already trying to micro him. Out micro him. Another mill. And now, Tatot is doing a tower to defend. All right. That's why he's now sending a spear. Trying to make the damage. I mean, he's creating chaos on top of the economy. He's spamming like it was Byzantines. Full of spears, skirmishers. Might do the tower. The tower here just to mining camp. To make a mining camp. And there's the spear. Oh, uh oh. Start walling and... And he's walled the wood line already. He's on the left, and now he's mining stone. Obviously, more army for Lear, but the tower here helps. But he's gonna cut outside very soon. Pretty much the same. Both players, similar approach. Well, actually, faster because he's with two villages here. Not the same. He put him away from uh, the berries, and he's being annoying. Didn't kill yet anything because. Well, without fletching, they're weak. Now look at this. He's just gonna go outside, man. Yeah, smart. Very smart. Okay. He's waiting for... Going just to this area. And he's gonna make it. Because with one goal, he's not gonna be in time. Well, he's now with chopping with two. Alright. That's maybe gonna work. And he's doing more. And now, ooh, he didn't kill it. Tato 2 KD and Tato very smart. Yeah, he, he's, he has to be something unconventional. And in this kind of situations, Tato feels so comfortable. Here, now, oh, he smelled the scouts. He smelled the scouts. Okay. Did he could or not? Yes, he did. And now, it's mining gold, but the scouts are coming. And... Leary has one spear. Look at the mining cam. He's gonna react properly. Oh boy. He take one. He see it already. He's gonna hit more. He micro, man. He saw it, man. He saw it coming, so no problem. Look at now his resources. He has the economy to go up. It's gonna stonewall. Okay. But check Lear's economy again. What the hell? He sell the stone and he's going up to Castellich in a moment. What the hell is this? Stonewalls. Yeah, doing the blast bit, but he's up to Castellich, guys. So, when he start to... Oh, he wall it. He's now gonna make a palisade gate and he's gonna go full eagles now. Yeah. All right. Well. He's mining gold. He has the lumber camp and uh, almost no action. You know, almost no action. Sending a valley here. So he's gonna wall and get map control to be safe. He's doing forging. And now Lee just need to wall this area and then he's fine. Thank you for because he's gonna have the second barrack and now he's coming with towers. Now in 17 minutes when Lear is already up to Castellage. And he can see it. Okay. He's gonna send now a few villages. Because the scouts are coming. No, no, no. Oh, this is many scouts. He's gonna work. Uh, well, sending the spears probably. He's gonna make the plus one or gonna make some upgrades. We will see. You need to send some spears and he's gonna try to out micro him with those. Okay, you need to send another spear. I think Lear is kinda overcommitting here. It's a mistake. He's gonna take now a few villages here. He lost more. Okay, and I don't know why Lear is sending this. It's not needed. 
He's almost in Castellage. Now he's gonna send more Spears, okay. Gonna lose another one. He lost six billion here, which is terrible, man. He's in Castellage still. Eagle Warriors, but this wasn't needed and now he's gonna kill the billions to his opponent, so he's gonna be the same at the end. Oh my god. Yeah, well, we'll see. Eagle Warrior, still no upgrades. Coming with more Spears, plus one armor. You need to wall this area. He's gonna wall or not? He killed now two. Okay. And? The Spears are coming and the Eagles can go around and make the damage. He's still not up. Sizzle is behind. Gonna make the third bar right? And I think Leo could be in a much better position. He did a, a mistake. He's gonna wall or not? What? Well, those are going to be... Those said Billy's got also the upgrades with the Plasmid now. So he's kind of wall here and... Oh, he's gonna come with... Uh, with a tower or something? He's walling here. Hitting all the map. Yeah. Okay. 19 army, 32. Eagles plus 2. It doesn't look like he cares too much about the map. Not right now. Bible is different. It's gonna be the same uh, at some point. Tato to God more idle and oh, oh, okay. Well, he's ready with the eagles. There's a lot of economy going down now for Tato. His efficiency already 40%. Not looking good. He is still gonna be up now, losing another and another one. Six five. Look at the village different now. Is not anymore. You know, okay. And he just have the map to be outside, but it's gonna take this tower. Yeah. He will try with the plus two. He's coming with more and he's spamming eagles. But you don't want to lose those units. Yeah. Well, um, Tato resources now, Tato the economy, almost no farmers. It's true that he still have some resources in the bank. But he's... Tugel is behind, 21 army. He's taking the tower. I don't know, man. He's gonna do now a monastery. Uh, some idle police here for Leary. Okay. He's just raiding constantly. He's raiding constantly. Three villains more. No army. He got eight eagles, 70 spears. Gonna take another. He's just spamming, guys. He's just spamming. I think with the monastery, he will be completely fine. He's doing right now. And uh, I know that the score is pretty much the same, but well, he's booming. Tatot is booming now, but he got more army now. The spears are coming. Oh man, the spear is going to help a lot. Huh? Maybe not that much. Okay. He underestimated the knights. The nice also with no bloodline, but you know, 120p, and now he cleaned those. Look at the army numbers. It's Palisade Gate here, okay. Mining a lot of stone, he's gonna make a castle or something. He's still going only, only one TC. Do you have more villains and more army? The score is kind of tricky here. It's true that the score is like this because Tato has killed a lot more units. But, yeah, well, the problem is that Leo is not even walling. Yeah, he's doing another Lambrican. Okay. And if you don't defend, you're gonna get raided and he might lose the game. I mean, if he's ahead, you know? Well, he's trying to take the tower and then keep raiding there. Yeah, with few monks, he's gonna be fine. But Tato is trying to make a counterattack, which might might do a lot of damage. Oh, look at this! Typical Leo with no walls. Okay, the knights are coming. Now he see it. Some monks, but he's now raiding. Okay, and here, skill in economy, man. It's killing economy here. It's under the TC. No, no, no. Yeah, gonna take the monk. Not really. 
He can now kill the stone miners. Remember that if he's dropping a castle forward can be dangerous. Ooh. Ooh. He sell all the stones, so there's no castles, man. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, here a mistake by, by Leary. Let's see the monk. He's now trying to raid more. This is a ridiculous game. Gonna make the farmers here now. And gonna take another. Got it. Light caps to go for the monks. Almost all the economy is inefficient now for both players. They are going wild. Look at the wood here. It should make another lumber camp. He did this one, okay, so he will cut at some point. He's gonna take the monastery. And okay, converting some eagles. Not really. He's going back. He should do maybe some pikes. Yeah, he's not spamming eagles anymore. He's doing more monks. But he's still ready? No. Tato has killed 11 villages. 7 lost here. 45 villages for both. Okay. Let's see if he's going to convert the knight. But this is so many knights. So many knights now. Yeah. Need to go back with the eagles. And Tato, if he's still... If Lee is still playing like this, he might take the game. Like, the pikes are... Yeah, it's the way to go. With pikes and eagles, then it's a different story. And he has the stone to drop a castle. So, he's gonna drop a castle here, Leary. Yeah, he wants to do that. But Tato is expanding his economy somehow. Yep. Outpost. Okay. Yeah, one castle will come. Or not. Castle here? He probably has to do it. He has the plus two, but uh, five pikes, 14 eagles. He has so many knights. So, okay. And he's coming, guys. Oh my God. Seriously? I mean, you cannot make... I don't know, Leo, if you have been playing all the game, but you cannot make the castles over the farms. You know? Over the farms is not possible. I'm not sure if you, if you agree with that, but... Over the farms is not possible. Now it has to be here. Yeah. That's gonna be a doubt castle? No, it's not gonna be a doubt castle. He has so many pikes and eagles. He got monks as well. So he's gonna make this castle. I'm gonna take the TC and all the farms. But now he's doing a castle himself. He got a lot of farming. Yeah. And then he will need to go here and raid. If he's doing that and raid outside, then Liu could have the advantage. Otherwise, he's in a problem. Because his uh, opponent is just booming. You know? <clears throat> well, this is gonna be down. But I insist. He needs to do something else. Not an old with only one TC. It's true that he has a lot of farming. Yes. And now he's gonna go around. Well, the TC is gone and the farmers are gone too. Good castle to defend these other farms. But he needs to raid here. If he's not doing, if he stay here, this is Tato's game. I might be wrong, we'll see. Yeah, he's gonna send the pikes now back home. He's gonna mine more stone. And Tato is just booming. Because Lee has a lot of farming, but he's not really doing a lot of damage. Tone Watch. Very important upgrade. Very useful. And this map even more. He convert an eagle. Yeah, no fletching, no horse collar. Well, it's kind of a weird game because at the end there is not a lot of action. Uh oh. He's gonna see now the castle here. Well, he knows that the castle is there. Gonna kill the monk. And he can see the farm here. Is Lee trying to go Imperial 1 TC? Maybe. No. He's doing now a second tone center. Dude, look at the castle he's doing there. 30 TC here. And you need to attack in the outside. I insist. Otherwise, Leo is dead. He's 24 villages behind. Kamayuks.
Yeah, I mean, he's too many bullets more. But a map that should be really aggressive became a boom map, right, guys? Like, you might think, oh, they have a lot of farming, it's true. Well, but they're booming. Yeah, this is a problem because now a castle here would be lovely, I believe. It's gonna make another TC, okay. Yeah, but I feel that this is kinda late to boom. Okay. A petar. Well, he has a TC, so he should be fine. He's gonna drop a castle here. Both have a stone to drop a castle. Kamayuks, more eagles, so might take the TC. And this is a lot of villages that now Liu can kill. A lot of villages. That can be huge, honestly. But what is Tato going to do here? Lose one and make some excellence? That TC is going to go down and killing this TC, as I said, 15 villages down. So the difference is not going to be that big anymore. Going now with the pikes, going around, but the pikes won't achieve too much either. And now, he's gonna kill so many villages to Tato. Wow. And here, he wall in the last sec. No, oh, he's not, okay. Now you have to be careful, he has to wall as well. Gonna take it, but some houses. Yeah, and wall maybe. Yeah, well, he need to send all the Kamayus, and if he send, the Kamayus might dominate. He need to repair the TC. He's not repairing and gonna lose also a lot. Now the gate, but let's see. He's gonna send the pikes or not. He got pikes and, and monks. It's four villains different, guys. It's crazy. Four villains different. Now he's gonna change again because he's losing a lot here. Yeah, if he wallet, but this happened, guys, because Leary is overconfident. Like his opponent, oh. Ooh, okay, well, I mean, he's a stone walls and he didn't have even, he got a palisade, you know, a palisade gate. If he just made a stone walls, he will be fine. But now he didn't let him make a castle and he's going to make a castle here with seven villages. Okay, but this is the Kamayus and the Kamayus dominate. Yeah, again, 20 villages different because he didn't wall. Now the castle. Ooh, taking the relic. Okay. Well, I think Tato should win this. Again, because he's 20 villages, man. And all those Axemans. You could also say, well, he didn't wall also here. True. Uh oh. Oh no, the Axemans dominate there. Oh boy. What he's gonna do now? Taking relics. One month more for sexy anniversary, mem. Thank you, man. Albandi, how you doing, man? 16 moons. Okay. 20 villains more, and we are waiting for Imperial, guys, because now they can't. With this map, you can't kill each other. They have castles all over, they are kind of locked down, and the one who reach Imperial faster win. Maybe not even that, because Tato now has a lot more. You know? Okay. And now? And now? Ooh, two houses. But a couple of monks. We'll, kill the, we'll take the Axemans. One Axeman. Maybe the second. And now with two Axemans and, and Kamayus, you will kill those. Yeah, this is a castle that he's gonna make us on his face. But uh, I don't know if we should do that. Lee has still a lot of farming. Okay. Oh. Oh. He almost gets in. Just a wall. So the stone wall here. And now he's ready. Knights and Axemans. Tato got the 1-1. One, one, in my opinion, you know. Now let's see. Yeah, more ready. Did the wall and population. 116, 140. He's gonna make the castle here. Yeah. The, the, the camels are strong, but... He's now chasing shadows. Okay. He's doing another tone center. 
And another one. He's walling. Okay, we still have a lot of army. Siege war shop. To do what? Few, sc few scorpions? Maybe? Another village down. Tattoo kill 35. Bleed 26. Yeah, this is impossible. I mean, I don't think Liu can do anything anymore here. He keeps trying, but more castles. He has now 20 villages more. Hand card already, not even horse collar. Okay. Doing mangoes to, to, to reach the, the Axeman. He has spikes, okay. GG. GG call 1-1. One, one. Tato played this much better, you know. Much, much better. He was just walling the map and taking map control. And even if he was looking, that could be much stronger uh, game from Lee. But I think Lee played a bad strategy here, you know. Yeah, really bad strategy here by him. Tato did the right one and you can see the kills and the economy also much better. So guys, let's go for game number three. Game number three, Ghost Lake. And why I say oh, because Ghost Lake is a map that um, I didn't think that could be the, the main one to pick for the kid, for Leary. And he has picked Tatars versus Vietnam. Okay. Um, in a map like this, I think I prefer Vietnam. You know, sorry, Tatars. Don't know what you think, guys. Tatars with the domination, right? Vietnam is still very strong. And even more now with the with the huge boost, you know, that they have. But but let's see. Remember, guys, that after this series, the Viper versus Hera, last quarterfinal of the day. Okay? So let's see. We have Liri as a green now, Tatot as a red. And um mm, 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 mm. What are they planning to do here? Because this usually is not a super aggressive map because it's very easy to wall. And look why I'm telling this. Tatot map. Berries at the back, gold at the back, stone at the back. Easy to wall here. Yeah, and you are safe completely. Perfect map. You know, obviously the front is a little bit more open, but you can wall with the wood lines. It's so easy to wall. Really easy to wall, you know. Well, for Leary, uh, you need to wall farther, and then you can still be okay. -ish. But definitely better map for Tatot. He has the berries at the back, stone at the back, but all the gold are kind of on a side. This is very open, and this one, you know, a little bit more work to wall. I'm just leery. It's lazy with the walls many times. This can be a, a good situation for Tato. Also, Tato, remember, he knows where his opponent is, so he's trying to probably take sheep. Remember, for Tatars, 50% more food. Okay? Okay. Yeah, he's controlling all the ships right now. He's controlling all the ships right now. Everything should be good now. Okay. Tatot is still pushing all his economy, as you can see. 
Leary has tried to explore a little bit his opponent, but he didn't. So he might believe that he's here. Well, he doesn't know. And he's up 18 population. Four seconds out on TC. Want to go super quick up. So his plan is to go very aggressive. Even if the map is super wallable, because it is, he doesn't care. He play aggro no matter what. That dot 19 population. Oh boy. Okay. So he's gonna make the barrack. He's pushing the deer. No mill. Look how fast they are going up, guys. You know? It's crazy. And he has 11 ships with... Uh, yeah. Crazy. Really crazy. With Tatar's bonus. Now the barrack. Okay. And who will go archers? You know? He definitely will go archers. He's mining gold. And we know Lear is right, so... No surprise. Leary style. Arches and quick. Can't wait for her versus Viper. Me either, man. I really want to see. Sadly, it's Can't wait too many for her v Viper. Sadly, it's too, too many C's and they we start quite late to stream this. So it's going to be a little bit late for many people. Also for me, because he's, he's already 22. And uh, yeah, it's a pity because of that, but... But still, hopefully you guys are going to stay and enjoy with Viper and Hera. Remember that since the host is Argentinian, well, in, in South America it's probably a better time, you know? And obviously this, he's trying to probably see for his audience, which is normal, right? But for more, you know, it's a little bit, uh, it's a little bit late for sure. It's stable, and he can see it. Okay. Two delays on goal, three delays on goal. Okay. And now he's walling all the map. Yeah. Walling all the map. Expected. So Lee will have to go very aggressive or problems. Yeah. Because you want to make damage when you are going that quick up, right? He's sending army now. One spear and one archer. Obviously, with one spear and one archer, you are not going to kill too much. But you, you try to be annoying. Oh! Tato is going archie range as well. And very fast. I mean, I like it, but I'm surprised he's doing that quick. Because if you are walling completely, you should be fine. He has now five on goal. Plasmid. He's really going to have the fletching already. Oh, wow. Fletching minute 11. Not bad. If he's clicking, of course. He's not. Okay. He's doing now. And if he send all the archers now, well, if he send three, four archers with Fletching, that's definitely something. But doubt. Sorry. Tatot fully wall. I'm thinking in doubt, guys. Because he played amazing today, guys. Oh, okay. Platinum. I wonder if people read the title or check the logos of the host and the sponsors, you know? Crazy. They don't read, guys. They don't read, guys. Nothing. Ay, ay, ay. Anyway. Spears and archers. Well, he's coming now with army, but he has no fletching. So, depend what micro has now Leary. No, Leary will be fine. He's doing a good tower. He's not gonna be wall completely too. Obviously these walls are bad because he didn't explore. Yeah, I mean, walls has to be like this, but still. Tower is fine and now he will have a lot of arches here. So if he does have a hole, it's gonna be completely fine. And he does have a hole. The problem is that Tato has a lot of farms here, but he cannot afford as much. 
Hands leader because he has wall a lot, but he did a stable, RT range, so no plasmid. And now, with this army, I think Liu is gonna kill. Yeah, he's not doing any damage. Look, he has no fletching. So now, I'm going to Tato's point of view. We'll borrow super fast because this is the new Vietnam. But he's gonna clean this. Everything. I mean, the scouts might run. Might run away, maybe. Yep. With the scouts, you can kill those skirmishers. Yeah, he killed them all. Yeah, I know the scouts are going away. No army for Tato. Five army, 13, and resources for Liri looking really good. With less farmers, but he has this, the ships from Tatars. So, Liri is about to go up to Castleage very soon. While now Tato is mining gold, he's doing more skirmishers. That's gonna be dangerous. He's doing the stable, he has to be careful to make a house here. Yeah, and another one. He's still open. I think that's open, right? Yeah. He's going to to dive in. Oh, that's that's really dangerous, man. He's gonna lose all the scouts. Oh my god. Okay. And he's up to castle. This is insane. It's, it's, it's insane, man. He has fletching. He got all the archers here. Now. He's gonna have Tatars with Thambrin. Those scouts are going to go down. And it's crazy how how fast they go castle is these players. Yeah, really. Yeah, and all the scouts, bye bye. Bye bye. Question is, he's gonna do what? Crossbows into what? He has a stable, gonna do light cuts maybe in case that he's doing skirmishes exactly. Tatars is now going up. Okay. 45 second difference, which is almost nothing, and with Will Barrow, but Will Barrow with uh, Vietnam, it's 100% faster, that's why he has the same villages, it's crazy. Okay, but he has no army, yeah, and how are you going to be able to stop now Tatar's archers that are going to be with Thumbrin, he's doing now fletching, if he's breaking in and he will, he's going to dominate, Tatot will need to wall more, in my opinion. I don't know, let's see. Obviously, if he's not breaking in, then he's fine, but uh, uh, let's see. Can be a problem here for Tato. Still open, not fully, but you know. And, oh, well, he didn't explore anything. So yeah, it's fine. The spears need to go back. Leary, eating the TC, all right. The scouts, I think he will explore. Why he's going away with the scouts? I don't understand. But now he's going around. Okay, this is good. Botkin arrow, crossbows, poof, siege workshop. But he's gonna break very fast. Like really, really fast. He's doing the market, okay. Is he doing some cavalry? No, he's already in. He's gonna be in Castle in a moment. The market just to block. He's fully wall. Lee has the timing, the momentum, but not gonna be easy to kill Elise Kermishes. Siege workshop with two bullies. And here, no knights, no lancers. Yeah, he's gonna make TCs now. Tato is going for the boomy approach. Extra TC, skirmishes, but Lee trying to go very aggressive here. The scouts, yeah, in danger, but he's taking farmers. Well, it's something. Not a lot, but something. And these skirmishers. I insist, the tambourine matters. No armor. And those skirmishers can be now deadly. It's gonna try to go from this area. Ooh. Ooh. This can be a trap. But Lee read this as well. And he's going out of this area. Going to the hill, probably. No, no, no. You don't want to fight against the skirmishers. They are so strong. But the mineral is coming and gonna hit Villiers. One Villiers down. Two mineralls then. Now he's doing a siege workshop too. Five Villiers ahead. Lead 12 seconds idle PC. Now Tatot will start to have idle because he got two tone centers. So it's not terrible. But he's going very aggressive. Will he have siege? Yes, he will. 
till he cannot see it. And there's no monks to convert. Gonna make an outpost and turn the watch. I like that a lot. Speaking fire, but the Mangonel is there. Yeah, the outpost is gonna give a lot of information. Obviously, it will be better in this area, but still trying to hit. The score almost the same. Still, is only two difference. He's gonna repair. Oh, oh, oh. And the Mangonel is coming. Lee can see it. He react for properly. Yes. He's gonna repair now that Mangonel. He will try. He's, he has one knight. He doesn't know if there's monks. So if he's doing few knights and send, he will dominate. But he might be thinking, maybe he got some monks. And that's not good. Where's the knight? At home. He will send it. He's coming with the skirms. Oh. Okay. Ooh, the micro. He got it. Oh my god, that's terrible for Tatot. He lost two mangroves while Lee lost none. That's really, really bad. Really, really bad. He take both and now he's gonna take the RT ranges. This is very expensive, you know? Like, really, really expensive. You're gonna take the RT range. 66 population, 71, doing the skill guard in armor. And now, he see the skirmishers. He's doing the skill guard in armor. Plus one, coming with another. And now, oh, lucky. Lucky. Oh my god. Well, He's one for one. He's trying and repairing in the last second. Oh boy. But now the knights are going to dominate here. This is where the skirmishes are now going to be destroyed. Even more with the plus one. Okay. Tato is still trying. He has six bullets more because he has two tone centers. But he's getting corner. Full corner. He's gonna send now the knights. Probably he will. But he's losing all the skirms. Oh wow. Triple TC now. And he's still attacking. All in Leary. Doing another mangle. Let's see if he's gonna see now. He see it. So he's gonna react. Yes, he will. Almost. But he didn't kill it. He can send the knights now to the left. Oh, he lost a player. Sloppy. Yes. Sloppy boy. And that mangle. Oh, almost. He didn't kill it. Okay. Yeah, that's why the village forward is so important. If he take the TC, is huge. Because he take all the farms and the goal is unprotected. Oh my god. Well, good micro now for both. Whoa. He split the units. He moved those archers in the last second. He could kill a lot and he took only two. Great micro by both. Okay. And that army? Still trying. Super intense game. Gonna take the mangonel. One for one. No. Now he took one here. And Lee is starting to lose mangonels. He need to repair. It's complicated, man. It's really complicated. You can see how Lee is trying to put all the pressure. You know? And even if it looks like he's super ahead. Look at the score. Well, Tato is still with 10 billions more. You know? Seems that it's easier to boom for the defensive player. But his economy is not better, in my opinion. Even if he's 10 bullets ahead. Okay. Gonna take it? Not really. I think he just did a few knights. Uh-oh. He's going to repair. Ooh. Good minor shot. Because there's a lot of idle time, I believe, from, from Tato. Okay. Yeah, he's controlling both players. Now look at the man gonna here. He's gonna take it. No! It's not taking and not taking again. Now he will. No, he didn't take it. Thank you for the soup, guys. Super intense, the micro. Now Tato take it. Okay. And what Leo need is few knights. When the knights has come, everything is gone. Now Cisville is behind. Okay, gonna take it. No. Well, NBL will, will enjoy in this battle so much. You can see the knights now. And taking now the mangroves with only the knights. The mangroves are gone. And he will kill. One, two, three, and took them all. Both lost a lot. And the game is starting now. <laughs> 84, 87. But I like it, man. This is the games we love it. Not those games that are booming all and no action. What the hell? Disaster, those games. Anyway, outpost won't happen. It's gonna kill it. Yeah. And at the end, Lee kill more units, but. Uh, who has a better economy here? Ooh. Okay, one for one. No. Oh, this was very good for Leary. Not anymore. Yeah, now he will. Uh, he got it. Oh, my lord. The two mangoes now killed. 
bloodlines and now double is table gonna start to spam knights i believe chain in armor he feel that now his economy is solid enough to make knights population both almost the same now tatot house it he has no abilities in front and more archery ranges it's gonna mine gold he's trying to counter attack but He's coming with forward abilities again, but he's gonna catch up with those arches. He's lucky now, Tato. Gonna see it? Yeah? Fill it down. Yeah? Well, the knight will clean those. He wanted to come forward to repair. Look at the score. Still is scary. And. Oof! He didn't kill it. Okay. He didn't kill it either. And all the arches not going forward. He's going to go again. They have to be paying attention to millions of things, guys. He got it. That was really bad. Now, ooh, but those Mangoras are really low HP. That's why he needed those villains forward. And now the knights are coming. It's nine knights. This army is going to be really difficult for... 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 Tato to stop, in my opinion, because he's knights plus two, and he has no no numbers to stop this. Casbandry even two immortal sentences. Now he need to come with the crossbows. What is he doing here? That's he should wait. Well, he's gonna clean all. Yeah, and now the archers. What happened? He need to come, but he's not coming. He's gonna lose all the units here. Yeah, Tato is gonna get clean. He's losing a lot, and now Leary. Nothing. GG call. Um, it's crazy because I think Tatot is paying a lot of attention to the score. Because if you check, he's nine villains ahead. Nine villains ahead, but he feels that Leo is dominating here. You know? Remember that they don't see what we do. He sees that he's 600 score ahead, that he's coming with a castle forward, that with the knights he cleaned everything and he really clean. I mean, he's behind. He's really behind. Like, He's gonna have a castle here, he's not many stone. But you see that he's nine villains ahead and feel that the game is closer. The game is not really as close as it looks, you know? Leo has the important advantage, you know? Yeah. Statistics, military, he killed 14 more. Economy, Tatot was with more economy in total, but it was wood mainly. More full Leary and more gold, you know? And he got more villains, but well, yeah, I think, you know, we are used to some players that are trying with 3,000 score behind, right? That's why we see those resign and we think that why not a little bit more, right? Game 4, let's go. Game number 4, guys. Moras. The one with the surface. The one with the surface. Dravidians versus Romans. Okay. Dravidians versus Romans. All right, all right. Well, Leo with Dravidians, Tatot with Romans. Let me check the civilizations. What do you prefer here? I never prefer Dravidians, you know. But if Leo pick them, maybe he think this better? What do you think, guys? What do you think, amigos? Which one is better? Come on. Do you need to tell me, guys? You need to tell me. Okay. One moment, guys. Mm -mm -mm. I have a problem and I'm fixing now because I'm working on Warlords 2 right now. Okay, it should be now fix it. Anyway, nothing is happening right now. This map is a lot about the shortfish, okay? A lot about the shortfish, as we all know. And, uh, well, they will have a meal soon here on the shortfish. Yeah. Three bullets on wood. Dravidians, obviously, with the shortfish is insane, but you only have range units no cavalry 
But you know what? Might be fine because um, Romans might go infantry. Or he's gonna change because he's in Dravidians, guys. You know? It's, it's what it is, man. Hey, man, do you know any good VPN? Oh my god, thank you for asking. Such a brutality, guy. Okay. You don't know what I just did it. Because that was a small mistake and I just fixed it while I'm casting. And yeah. Uh, Stupid for YouTube and you know. For Warlords 2 and everything. Uh oh! Mill here. He's gonna lose that Valir. A sloppy boy. That's gonna be annoying. He should move that Valir probably to home. But he's going away. You don't want to take a lot of HP down. Yeah. So, is Dravidians maybe going to go mana times also? The thing is, you don't want to fight mana times versus Romans. Because if he's going Romans and he's getting the double... Well... The bonus for the... Uh, for the Blasby, that it makes you plus two. Okay. Did doubt win, please. Uh, us for English. If you say did doubt won, it's not correct. You know, everyone knows that uh, this channel is about perfect English. Okay, thank you guys. Okay, three bullets on wood. I love to say this, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for the gift, and we keep going, guys. We see how Tato is up super quick. Lee is going up now, 17 seconds. Idle tone center. Sloppy, yeah, he's going up slower with some idle, and he's doing malicious. So both are going malicious. All right. Yeah, but he will get, remember, extra wood. So he will do RT range, and now he's getting some damage. That scout. Two militias, and he'll have two militias as well. Three militias already. Okay, he's going to go back. Let's see now. He's doing an older four militias, what the hell? Okay. Well, that's a good micro. That's a really nice one. Not anymore. Because now, now the, oh, the tiger is still going for red. Oh, that's pretty crazy, man. What the hell, cheating. Perfect English here. Now gonna take this one, the damn tower. Oh my God, the tiger. Yeah, three militias now, and he's still doing. Now Menatarm, he's gonna do Menatarm, yes, right away. Okay, and a second barrack. So, He's not going archers. He's doing the blasmith. Okay. Because he knows that he will have the upgrades. Doing now the mill. Doing a tower as well. And both. Oh, oh. Okay. He wallet. Doing the tower. He can see the second mana The second barrack. This is open, so. You need to wall. Well, the tower is going to be up. Supplies and he's also inside here. Oh, Tatito, 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 he didn't notice. Well, he did, but he's gonna kill a villager. No, he's going back. And here, he need to go back too. Or problems. Lear reaction, zero reaction. Uh oh. Well, he has the tower and not losing anything here. The thing here is. He has two barracks and oh, he can't trap. 
He kind of trapped. He's gonna lose a Valir. Got it. But he went to the TC also. Tugel is behind. He did double Barak and he's not doing mana taps. Now he's doing. That's kind of weird. Yeah, he's idle TC doing the Blasmid and don't think the Lee is playing great here. Idle TC for Leary a lot. One minute, 20 seconds. It's crazy idle time. But he has a lot of farming. And we all know that in a map like this, maybe having that much army is what matters, you know? He got the plus two armor, but he has numbers. Is the plus two going to be a nose? It seems to be. Yeah, man. It's pretty crazy. He has mana times with the plus two. Okay. Five, two. Only two alive for Tatot. Okay. Still more and more idle TC, but it's going to go. And if you take the short fish, problems. Real problems. It's now 1 minute 40 seconds. What the hell? Is he doing the list? Liu is a bot, guys. He's not doing the list. He's an AI. <laughs> I think this game is over, honestly. I don't know how Liu is going to be able to win here. And we might see a decider. I don't know. We'll see. I mean, Liu is still ahead with the score. And a lot more army. Yeah, man. The economy is not that crucial here. Five men at arms against three. He did the blast but he's not doing the upgrades. He should have the upgrades. It's plus two, man. The goal is very close to the tone center. And let's see the battle. No, he's doing another. I think here he should destroy it. Yeah. With the upgrades he has. Ooh. He's coming with some here. Okay. Villier down. And, and he can kill, but need to focus. Oh my god, the micro here by Lear. It was better. With the mana times, he lost them. And he doesn't have the upgrades. Now he has the plus one armor, so he can kill this one. He didn't. And he's coming with more. Did he make supply status? What the hell? I was telling, but he's still five dollars behind. Okay. Well... Liu is definitely controlling the army better. Tato is controlling the, the, the economy a lot better. It's three minutes at LTC. What the hell, man? I mean, seriously? Do you need a minimum? Eco Peace. <laughs> okay. Aliri, do not notice, man. All right. Now he does. He did it. He's going to the tone center and eating the TC. And in this area, poof. He's gonna destroy, man. What the hell? He sacrificed the TC just to have millions of army, man. Whoa! It's so many. He can now kill a lot. Okay. It's still eight villains behind, but how much army he got here? Oh, one million down. It's 69. It's, 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 it's crazy, man. Now another villain here. Liu has killed already four. He's gonna take all the mana times here. What the hell? Or maybe not. He got forging. Well, forging as well. Okay. He stabilized a little bit, but he's still on the right. And here, those two mana times. All right. He's taking just the stragglers. This game, guys. Liu is still with more population. Doing a Lambert camp in this area. And uh, both mana times, but Liu doubled the army. Another mana term here. Okay, he will kill a Belier? Probably not. He has the tower. That's good. But he's moving here. And. Uh, oh man. Uh, well, he's walling. Need to go back. He's. Oh, okay. He trapped a lot. You know, many men at arms, but he's coming with more. He trapped how many? Many, many men at arms here, but he's coming with a lot. With more here, and you need to kill the gate. The damn gates, guys. The damn gates that can't change the game, maybe now. But they he's still sending a lot. 16-9, but it's still idle. Ooh. He's gonna take this one. He's taking now. He has the upgrades. He's still killing here. No, no, no. He lost a lot of them. And now, he's still spamming forever. 33 villains, 36. What the hell? 3 villains different only? With 4 minutes idle tone center? He has killed five, doing the bur uh, taking the berries now. These men at arms are gonna die against the tower. He should kill the gate. But he doesn't have a space there. Okay. But he's killing them all. Still, Roman has 
remember more uh, better upgrades and now we don't see this often and now he's gonna take a leery oh my god oh my lord 14 army 6 army is still more population crazy game already mm, can be the last of this series well we don't know it's impossible to know but this tower is huge and Tato does have a stone this tower it's probably probably well 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 don't want to say that probably in the game but it looks like because now he got to get the tower down he's coming with more mana times he's so many it's incredible man it, it is really incredible he's doing another tower here Ooh. okay it's a counter attack now by by tato he's walling but he has mana times and more are coming no he got so many he got so many man really so many but who is winning here what what okay Killing more 10 villains to 2. Look at now the villains number and another one down 11 to 2. Unbelievable. Same villains for both players, you know. Same villains now for both players. GG, good luck, Nest. What the hell? But Tatot kind of give up too early this series, guys. I mean, 3 1. Lear is in the semi-final, but look at the population. Thank you for following. 36, 35, 6, 5. Uh, well, as I said, he has the feeling, guys. I mean, we don't know. Because Tato doesn't know that Lear has five minutes at LTC. And he's just feeling like, I lost a lot, you know? I lost a lot. That's why you probably need to... To keep going a little bit, you know, just a little bit, guys. Leary three Tato to one. He will be in the semifinals, Leary, and now we will have, you know, the series we will have 45, 46 economy. You can see the resources better for Tato a little bit, and uh, well, four villains more also. But guys, Leary is in the semifinals. Hopefully you enjoy this series. Thumb up, subscribe, leave a commentary. We love this game, guys.